All right, it is late at night, I'm aware. Today's episode of Pokemon is probably gonna be a weird one. You see, um, there's a bunch of trainers down below that we needed to, um, clean up. Uh, that's something I want to do. I wasn't quite sure how to do it. So I think what today's episode is going to be mainly is just like a bunch of trainer battles. I know I like to comment on trainer battles, but I don't think it's always going to be the most interesting thing in the world. So uh, today we're like just doing a bunch of trainer battles. Like there's some down here. I think ahead of time you can go up and do some trainer battles, so that's what we'll be doing today. You're not a trainer battle. Oh, you're um the obligatory one. Oh, sure. All right. Didn't mean to do that, but that's something we can start off the episode with. Okay. Well, um, uh, thank you, buddy. How about you, Officer Cop? I am just a- I am literally 10 years old. This man has not slept in like a month. Growlithe, do you think, um, Vesalius would be able to take a hit? I hope you don't get obliterated, buddy. Oh, or that could happen too. I don't want to waste my pivot, so we're, we'll just try again. I got two eggs to juggle here, so like... That still does 11. Oh wow, okay, this thing's just like real strong, I guess. Okay. Yeah, it's a Growlithe. I guess we'll use you, Clevis. Just getting Poseilius some experience would be nice here. Or not. This is, uh, fun. Uh, we're definitely not going to take much damage, so I'm just going to, like, set up here. Because I feel like this is going to be a pretty slow back and forth we're going to have here. So just like prepping what I can, I think is going to be a good idea. Kind of a shame we don't have Leer or whatever to um boost up my tackles. Because it's still going to be a few. Ah, that is such an annoying move for training like this. Hopefully he won't be able to land too many attacks. Also, we are faster with Kenneth, so... This should still go alright. Okay, I was gonna say that's really strong, but... 17 on a crit, we can handle that. Oh, that was a real messy first battle. Poseilius did get a level, though. I... I thank you. I don't know why you attacked me with your dog. I mean, I guess you are a cop. And uh, we're gonna go up and heal because we took an, an appropriate amount of damage there. And I can just edit around it, so who cares, right? Alright, here's someone we can potentially battle. What's up with you, buddy? Okay, fellow child, we are bad. Something that's always nice. Two Pokemon. It is worth noting I don't have a Pokemon list in front of me. So I am kind of doing this just, like, blind. Like, a lot of the times I know, like, what Pokemon these trainers have with them. But not today. Ember's got a one-shot, right? And I'll use Kenneth because he's so close to getting another level. Okay, 
just like that. Diglett, um... We'll switch Train Telenest into Poseilius, because Poseilius is obviously who we're going to use here. That's a good animation for Diglett. I'm guessing it's going to dig. I, but since Wooper is slow, we might like go second and get a hit in. No, it's a scratch. It only does six though, we're good. And we're a special attacker, so that does not matter. This is gonna one shot, right? Not even half. I mean, it's close, like, given how much it's doing, that's not like a major concern. Just, you know, I need to complain about something, right? And there we go. Okay. What do you have to say after? Well, you gotta try harder, child. Is this a trainer? It's kind of weird positioning since you'd kind of have to go out of your way to interact with her, but... I mean, I guess the idea is like you're gonna be pushed to the left from the spinning guy. Hoplit, hoplip. Is a grass type hoplip? It's kind of bad, but we use Kenneth just for the fun of it, you know. Just to make things go easy. Go quick. I don't think go easy makes sense. Also, what's with the dots on hop hips here? Is that supposed to be like lighting? Also, how come we're getting like no experience points here? Okay, you just how you're from Kanto, I guess. I'd love to be able to use like some flying type moves with Telenest, but um, uh, we're not there yet. Oh, that actually sucks. I mean, we're gonna one shot it. Does it? Leech seed still is gonna drain if like. You're on a different Pokemon, right? Like, we're gonna switch out right away. It's not gonna do it this turn, because I got a KO, and the next turn, we're gonna be switched out, but, you know. I don't know, I need to talk about something, right? Well, both level 9 can. Like, how much does Telenas do? Defense drop, that's um, a bit concerning. I think grass is physical. So I, I'm i pretty sure Telenest could win, but I don't, I'm not gonna risk it just because why. Does it only know Splash? I'm gonna take a chance. I'm gonna say that this Hoppip only knows Splash and... Oh, well, it... There's no synthesis, so we won't be able to damage it fast enough. Unless maybe the um, get defense drop, or whatever. But whatever. Let's not make things hard for ourselves. Just for the purpose of making things hard for ourselves, right? Alright, you got anything fun to say? Oh, okay. Sure thing. I, I'm getting phone numbers today too, that's something exciting. How about you, old man? Spinning around in a, a field at midnight? Okay, there's just a child with you, that's cool. 
double I always I've been entrained by gen uh, the, the new generations it's not a fairy type in this one it's just a normal type That's what a scary face looks like. I love how every animation is just like laser beams. Also, how much faster are, are we that we got, I'm guessing cut in half and we still, um, a lot of stuff happened there as processing it, that we're still moving first. I don't like how the other Pokemon can have an item. That's unfair. It's, it's fair. It's only fair if only I, the protagonist of the universe, can do things. Man is confounded. That's something to keep in mind. How about you, buddy? So you're the like first trainer in this area, right? I don't, I don't like how you have like bags under your eyes and that. Rattata. Rattatas are tough. Can Telenest actually take this thing on on its own? Uh, quick attacks doing eight. I'm, yeah, I don't like how that matchups. Like, why did I, why didn't I go to Pesalius? I, my brain is not brain today. I don't think we need, we need an ember here. Pesalius kind of needs experience on its own, so we'll, we won't switch train for Pesalius. Cause like, uh, he's at level where like he benefits from training up. But he, he's strong enough he can train up on his own, but he's not strong enough he can switch train others. And he's still weak enough that he, like, needs training, so. When we get the chance, Basilius will do attacks on his own. Do battles. I, you know what I mean. Nice. Spiro, you know what? He, um... We'll use Telenest here. We'll switch. Oh, maybe we don't need to. I don't know how... Well, we'll see how. We'll trade blows or whatever. Attack drop, not great. But, um... I just want to see how much we take here. If I ever get to find out. Because I don't really, I never paid much attention to like how strong we Pokemon were as a child. I just kind of used them and just kind of like trained up until I won. Just grinded. Ground. Yeah, we're taking 10 damage. So I don't have any like actual intuition if like Telenest is going to be strong or not. Once again, should have switched into Basilius. Whatever. Telnest is like not very far from leveling up anyways, so... See, there you go, level 10. And we'll go home through the grass. Oh, there's another Spiro. This time, switch chain into Basilius. Like that. I'm a special attacker. I mean, I I technically am mixed, but I can just play around the growls. Okay. Well, it's not gonna be free, but I'm taking six, so. I don't think my next one KOs. But it doesn't matter, like, if... 
there was a risk of Spiro getting two crits in a row, or I do KO. Never mind, there was not a risk of anything. I was just paranoid. Mm hmm. How about you? Oh, good for you, kid. So that's everyone on this route. Any wild Pokemon want to ambush me? There we go. I'd rather catch something new than train. I wasn't expecting a drowsy, but we'll all try. Okay, well, this is going to be real boring. We'll try to catch this if we can, but, you know. Kanto, so by our rules, it's not really, like, super important to catch. Also, I don't think this thing has any attacking moves. Now that I said that, uh-huh, right on cue. You just got a punch in the face, and you're an owl. You should wake up. Use Basilius. If Basilius can't get it down to like a reasonable HP, good on you, bud. Then we won't um, catch it. How much will How much will a slam do? So we're only taking five. That's pretty good. That's the ticket right there. And now we try catching it, I guess. Lure balls for fishing Pokemon. I never remember. We're gonna have to buy more Pokeballs pretty soon. And just like that. That is vaguely threatening. Call you half hay. And now we'll head up back to the, um, uh, what do you call Pokey Center? Nurse Joy, I'll tell me. One thing I just thought of too, I'm gonna mention right now. So, like, this is kind of generally just a halfway point. I mean, you'll see by the video length. First thing I thought of, I'll mention this again next video because like I understand people won't want to watch this one. We can technically use Kanto Pokemon that evolve into like new Johto forms. Like do it do any of these bats? He does technically have one. And um So does Clevis, I believe. Yeah, Clevis has um, Sunflora. I think we'll go with Batsy. No, no we won't. Anyways, we're getting a phone call from Gina. I'll explain afterwards. Sure. Good to hear. Good, good conversation. I think, um, my bell sprout, whatever I called it, was better to have than my, um, uh, Zubat, whatever I called that. Because I'd rather have, like, the fire, water, grass mix than having, like, a crowbat to start off. I don't know how strong trainers are healer, but we're gonna find out. I guess. I didn't talk to anyone down below because I think that's like something interesting to include in the video. So I'll be saving that for later. Ah, uh, 15. I believe in you, Vesalius. Let's 
That's unfortunate. Seven damage. Okay, well, you're going to be taking a bit more of a beating than I would have liked, but... You know, that's a little concerning. That is also a bit concerning. Because we were taking seven per hit before. It's not double immediately, right? That's a speed tie anyways, I guess. Look at that, you're strong, Celius. Yeah, how you like that? Yep, yeah, same. These two? Just a guy. Oh, okay, I guess. Yeah, doing that post with her dominance is a good start, I think. Alright, uh, same level. We're going in with some damage, which is unfortunate, but... I believe in you, Phacelius. That is unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. I'm getting hit with my own medicine. But it does not matter. It does matter. How much do we take? Eight. And we're never gonna hit again. We're in uh, crit range. We're not in crit range. So we're just gonna keep pushing our luck here. I don't have my hopes up though. Oh, I do have my hopes up. Let's go, little buddy. And what's next? Meryl. Technically, I have a type of disadvantage with, um... Oh, and level 15, you know what? This looks like a good time to use our pivot. I wonder how much damage Cleavis is actually gonna do. That's about what I expected. That's it, kill me. You little creature. Well, this is gonna be... Oh, that is not good. Okay, first off, we gotta stop rollout in its tracks there. Not liking where this is going. There we go. Now we do, now we start the damage. Cause like, yeah, we're not gonna do a lot of damage. I don't know how many like, smoke screens to use based on how much damage you do. Because it almost feels like we should have another one up. Or not. It's level for Telenest. We're in the pack. That is something, I guess. And what do you got to say for yourself? Yep. Just cuck this kid, although... I will say, he did quite a number on me. We're gonna go heal again. And we're gonna go, um, take, like, we're, I don't, jeez, buddy, get out of my way. I don't know if we're gonna clear out that area up there. I don't know how many trainers are up there, but we're gonna, you know. I don't think this would be a good standalone video, so we're just gonna keep doing this for a while, and that's gonna be a thing that happens.
Just, you know, showing off what battles feel like. Alright, now we gotta take on this woman. Oh, okay, sure, that's a, that's unfortunate, but I mean, as long as you're okay with that, I guess. That's, that's a cute animation for Pikachu, as you'd expect. Alright, I am a bit scared about what's going to happen here. That, I do not like that, I'm going to say that right now. I don't like my odds of taking it out immediately, so we're gonna, we're gonna do that here. We're just gonna match its double teams, I think, is a good idea. <sighs> Alright, well, this is gonna turn into a very stupid match very quickly. Okay, well, maybe I was wasting my time with the smoke screens. I don't know, I wasn't expecting that much damage. Although, I guess that's the problem right there. Okay, you're at max now, buddy. You can stop being like this. Yeah. Well, this is what next hour of my life is going to be. There you go, just like that. Pure skill, no luck. And that's Brick. Ah uh, yeah, what do you guys say after? <laughs> Okay, you just do not like your boyfriend, I guess. Okay, I think this should be pretty obvious what we're gonna do here. I'd rather take an attack drop than a defense. That is, um, concerning. It's just rocks falling on me, but it does 15 damage, that version at least. And we're gonna have to take another. Okay, that's better. Not that much better. Can Telenest to take on a Zubat? Don't like that. Alright, how much damage? I mean... I know the Zubat's not going to do much, but... I Having to deal with confusion isn't really worth it. I was probably going to use Supersonic again on Kenneth. Not if we outspeed and just obliterate it, though. Yeah, just like that. I don't think that crit was necessary, but I, it's a lot more emotionally satisfying, you know? We outspeed the Diglett, right? I don't think we can switch... We may not outspeed the Diglett at 14. Or we can take a Growl, no problem. Okay, please don't die, little buddy. I'm putting you in harm's way here. If we get, like, two more Growl- another Growl after, I guess. We should be good. I'm afraid for my life. 
three. Perfect. And there we go. Alrighty, that's... You know what, I'm not gonna risk it going any further. I don't know... How good of an idea this was as a video, but, you know... I feel like having a 30 minute block of battles is like... Good as like a change of pace for videos, and it's not going to like... Mean too much for tomorrow. I don't know what we're gonna be doing on the next like real episode of Pokemon. Like I don't know if there's a whole lot more to explore in this area. I'm going to discreetly grab my phone and I'm gonna check right now. And I'm gonna neglect hitting uh walking through this here. So I think that's gonna be the end of this video. I'm gonna double check here how many um how much longer that route is up there, but I'm thinking that's probably going to be it. Fun fact, there's a lot to do in this town. Route 35 going up. I mean, we took out, what, four trainers? And... Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think we're going to have another video just like this. Probably. We're gonna go up and we're just gonna keep like clearing out the areas Because there's just like a lot of trainer battles for some reason in a row And I don't know how else to manage them in my videos And doing kind of like long-form content like this. So yeah